What's up guys, welcome back to another video. So today's video is just going to be going over all of the male outfits in the game currently. And uh, let's look. So the ones I'm going to be listing, each when I get to each one I'm going to list, you know, where or how you get it. So starting off in the beginning, childhood outfit, this is just the one you start off with. Just playing the story. The villager outfit, this is the next one. Junior uniform story. Senior uniform story. Armory clothes from story. And coat of midnight from story. So all of those I just listed are, you're able to dye them so you can change the color like this one, it was black before, I just changed it to white. A uh, prize outfit from Kirito, I believe this is also dyeable, but you can get this from doing uh, the heart to heart stuff and getting, uh, you know, your Kirito's affinity stuff to, per or personas and animas and stuff to 100%. So this spirit armament, Yukikaze, this is from the add-on pack you can buy that includes four outfits and this is one of them. The next uh, outfit in the pack is Gale War Attire Shirogane. Next is the Black Swordsman Japanese style. This one is from getting the premium pass. So you can only get this if you have the premium pass. And also I said four outfits. One doesn't show up right here because that's a female outfit. And I've already shown that in the female outfit video. Now this Ice Thorn slash Goldflower Warrior Garb, this was given for free in the update long ago. It's for male and female. A Legendary Garb from a Distant World, Alfin. This is from the Tales of Arise collab, so this is how you get the, uh, the Alfin outfit. This one is just for free. It was given out in the recent update. Grand Chamberlain's clothes. I believe this is service quest related or just a uh, story. Either one of the two. Prime Senator's outfit, same thing. I believe it's story. Now these right here, these are just all given in a free update before. These are just NPC clothes. So you got Medicine Man, Peddler's outfit, Dealer's outfit, Lesser Integrity Knight armor. You can't die this one though, sadly. Gifted garb, Watchman's outfit, Excursion outfit, Comfy outfit, Crew Noble outfit, Comfy Noble outfit, Worker outfit, Proper Noble outfit, Former Noble outfit, Noble Daywear, Noble Nightwear, Sentry Uniform, Traveler's Outfit, Worker's Daywear, Wayfarer Armor. Now this one you get from doing um, either a certain amount of service quests or you can get it from uh, getting a certain reputation rank in the East or West region I believe. I got this one I think whenever my reputation got to a certain amount in the East region. But uh, doing some service quests, you should get this at some point. Prize outfit, Yu-Gi-Oh. This is from Yu-Gi-Oh's heart to heart, getting his stuff to 100%. And now we get to the cube items down here. So Machina outfit, this is from Volume 1. Electronic Disguise, Volume 1. Camouflage suit. Leopard suit. Now these suits, you can dye these. Sturdy suit. And then you got the t-shirts. Um, they just have different words on them. So this one says Kirito. Asuna. Bercoli. Selka. Lena. This is Butler suit. Cube volume 2. 
Desert Outfit, Q Volume 2. White Noise. Tiger Camo. Giraffe Camo. Yu-Gi-Oh! Shirt. Alice. Lisbeth. Silica. Ronier. A shirt that says what? One that says it's not a game. Taboo Life. The Savior. House Ortinanos. Childhood Friends. A shirt that has the code 871. Blacksmith Pride. Taboo Index. Wrath. And this one has Straya. This is her birthday t-shirt. Curry High birthday t-shirt. Seven birthday. Premier birthday. Holiday A t-shirt. This one was from around Christmas um, last year. They gave this out for free. So they'll probably give this out again um, in December. Uh, I don't know if they'll do a different version of it or if they'll do the same one, but they'll probably give another one. And this one, New Year's A, this was, this was from around New Year's, and uh, this is what they gave us. T-shirts again, you got Kaharu's birthday. If you don't know Kaharu, she is from the mobile game Integral Factor. Uh, Philia's birthday t-shirt. Itsuki's birthday. Zaliska birthday. Rain's birthday. And down here you get to the Q Volume 3 outfit. So this is combat clothes. This one is one of my favorites for the males right now. Got tribal covering. You can dye this one as well and it changes the markings color. And you got incognito suit. So that's it for all of the male outfits in the game currently. Like I said, most of these are just like most of these in the beginning right here. These are just free from free updates. Uh, uh, these listed here are from the add-on pack slash premium pass. And then everything else was just either free update or doing a certain amount of service quest. Or it's just the prize outfit that you get from heart to heart affinity game. And then just down here is Q Volume 1, 2, and then 3, and then those two t-shirts they gave out for free. But other than that, that was all of the male outfits in the game. And so I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.